Okay, more Mafia 3. We are going to meet up with Vito and discuss our next step against Greco. Vito's in this car over here. Greco's in that building oh, at the okay. end of the block. A lot of whoas in there. He's probably face down a pussy right now. You got any muscle with him? Yeah, a couple of meatheads. I'll go around the front, you take the back. He tries to run, grab his ass. Nobody kills that prick but me. Fuck. Those are Marcano's guys. Fuck. Come on, back to the car. You drive. I'll cover us. Fuck if that little prick gets away. <laughs> Let's get this cocksucker. Is, is that? How the fuck did Greco end up with my car? He's a little fuck, that's how. God damn it, why don't you just let Marcano handle this jackass? Marcano would just kill the little shit stain. I want to take my time. Besides, until I can get at Marcano directly, this is the next best goddamn thing. Point taken. You fuck's ready to die for this piece of shit, Greco! Huh? Around his ass. Oh shit! Don't shoot my car, Vito. Fuck! I ain't making any promises. No way I'm letting that dipshit get away. Here, it's tired. There we go. Oh! Shit! Once I'm done with Greco, you cocksuckers are next! Cover me while I reload! Oh, yes! Yeah. Over there! He's out of his car! I swear to God, this little shit's like a bad penny. What the fuck are you doing? He's running. Can I grab him? Ah, oh, shit. Turn Alan. Here we go. Fuck! Fuck, God damn it! The fuck are you? Let's get him the fuck out of here. The cops are closing in. Hey, get the door. Yeah. Dude's in his fucking underwear. Shake these corn having to get out of your house and running in the streets in your underwear. Hey Vito, uh, you know something about that, don't you, right? You know some a little thing or two about running around outside in your underwear? And your house got burned down? He's in the fucking trunk. Shit, how much police are there? How many fucking cop cars are following us? Oh shit! Oh, sorry! Oh my god! Oh shit! Damn, cops in this game don't fuck around. There's like fucking ten cop cars. This is worse than five star one and level one Grand Theft Auto. This is worse. Get the got stuck. There's another one. Holy shit! Dude! 
enemy cop cars are behind us. Vito, help us, you idiot! Do something, Vito! I can shoot these guys! Cop cars. And Vito's doing nothing. All units, suspect sighted in River Row. Another cop car. Oh shit! Holy shit! I'm stuck. Ah. Fuck. Fuck! Fuck! How the fuck did I get out of that? God damn! I made it! I made it. All units, negative visual yeah. suspect. Pull around to the chunk. Oh come on! And as for you, have a little dignity. Christ. How the fucking cops back? Why are they back? Watch out for cops. Don't want to get pulled over with this asshole in the back seat. They lost me again. Whew, shit. <laughs> for a couple of years there, I really thought I might be done with all the Jimmy Cagney bullshit. But here I am. Bunny, I kind of figured you for more the Edward G. Robinson type. <laughs> Look at you, kid. You know, God's got a sense of humor, too. It's sick as shit, but that motherfucker's got one. I'll Holy shit! I will make a How many fucking cops are following us? God damn it! That was a fucking epic child. cop chase. I don't know how I managed to escape that. Get in your car and get over here. Oh, oh, please! I didn't do nothing! Didn't do nothing? You were getting ready to fucking kill me! I was just doing what Uncle Sal told me to do! Ah, that fuck never liked me, I get it. But this? You never tried anything like this before. I don't... I don't... Come on, Mikey. Why do you want me gone all of a sudden? He said you were a carpet, baby. Never should have been down here in the first place. <laughs> you want me to keep going? You got nine more! Fuck! Listen, Jesus! He was worried you knew about the casino! And so we're gonna play up to Leo and the commission! What casino? Stop! Answer the question. Uncle Sally's. You, you, you see that construction across the lake? He's building a casino over there. He wants to go legit. Turn this city into Las Vegas. Gambling's illegal. Uh, yeah, no shit, it's illegal. <laughs> Which is why he's paid a bunch of money to get the loss chain. Who else is involved in this? I don't know. Uh, I don't know, I swear it. <laughs> I told you what you wanted to know. You're gonna let me go now, right? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Stupid fucking prick. 
I'll clean this mess up. No reason for you to stick around. Remember our deal. I'm expecting to cut of everything you bring in. Yeah, I know how this shit works. You'll get your money. It's a woman named Alma. Helps me out sometimes. Cuban. Mean as fuck. You should talk to her, see if she needs anything. Might be an easy way to bring in some extra money. Where's she at? At the warehouse. All right. What are you gonna do with him? Fish gotta eat like everyone else. At what point did you become aware that Sal Marcano wanted to build a casino north of the city? Pretty early on. Michael Greco told Lincoln about it. And Lincoln Clay's plan was to specifically target various entities related to Marcano's casino plan? Between the bribes he was paying out to get gambling legalized and the money needed to pay off the commission, Sal was stretched pretty thin. So Lincoln used that to his advantage. Forced Sal into making some extremely hard decisions. Decisions that would limit his options. I'm telling you, we make twice as much bread moving heroin as we would from a stupid fucking casino. Maybe three times. This ain't about the money. <laughs> You're joking, right? All I ever heard from you is, don't give me that goddamn excuses, you understand? You pay me what's fucking old! You think this is a game, <laughs> son? And it's my fault for playing along with you. We're not setting you straight. But it's not a game. This shit wears on you, grinds you down. I ain't had a decent night's sleep in 43 years. And then after Lucho, shh. But hey, we got the cocksuckers who did that. Every last one of them. Yeah, and your uncle's still dead, ain't he? Yeah. You think sitting in that chair makes you special, huh? Somehow puts you above all the bullshit. But it's the opposite. All it does is paint a giant goddamn bullseye on your forehead. There's a price to be paid for all this, you understand? And I'm tired of paying it. Mainly, I'm worried I'm going to get a phone call telling me you're dead in the gutter somewhere. What do you expect me to do, huh? Work the front door? Glad hand folks, as they come on in, maybe give them a quick slap on the ass? You run it with me. And here, after a few years, after I know everything's settled down, you'll take over. Find yourself a nice woman. Give me some fucking grandkids. Sound boring as fuck. It's the only way, son. The world is changing. Used to be people knew their place. Now everybody's screaming about equality. Now they all deserve a slice of the pie. Niggas, nicks, gooks, you name it. Our way of doing things won't work in a world like that. Yeah. You come to me with something like this, Lou, you better be goddamn sure. Yeah. Lincoln Clay is still alive. <laughs> Still alive, motherfucker! Alright, that was epic right there. Chasing down Greco, that car chase with fucking 10,000 cop cars. Cool cutscene. Vito's now joining us. Signed this to him. Fish gotta eat. Got the trophy. I am really digging Mafia 3 so far. Really cool stuff. Repetitive? Eh, kind of. Yes. Fun as hell. Fun as hell. Michael Greco is sleeping with the fishes.